There are many questions you will ask yourself only when you are in Japan. Questions about simple things in everyday life that are just different from what we are used to. To many of these questions you will never get an answer. This video, however, is here to change that. Here are seven questions you didn't know you had about Japan and their answers. Why are there small gaps between houses? Most buildings that are built close to each other in Japan don't touch. There is an often only centimeters wide gap between them. Why don't they just share the wall and save time, money and resources? The reason is earthquakes. When one building is collapsing, the small gap saves neighboring buildings potentially from chain reacting. Why do sumo fighters throw salt before competition? The ritual before each and every sumo fight includes the two contestants throwing salt into the ring. In Shinto tradition, salt is used to fight off bad spirits. Therefore, this ritual is used to purify the fighting area. Interestingly, this is the same in Japanese Buddhism. Therefore, for example, after visiting a funeral and before entering one's own house, one throws salt onto oneself in order to have anything malicious stay outside. Why are there so many vending machines? In Japan, there are over 5 million vending machines with products ranging from hot and cold drinks over fresh vegetables to flying fish stock. That's a really large number. So why are they so popular? There are many answers to this question. For example, that Japan is a really safe country and the machines won't be vandalized. That Japan is a cash-based society. Japanese like the ultimate things or they are just very convenient. But the real and only answer so this question is, there are so many vending machines in Japan because they are profitable. And they are of course profitable because of all the things I just mentioned. That and because they are not as overpriced as in other countries and actually fun to use. A short side story. On my first visit to Japan, I was staying at a business hotel in Shinjuku and I couldn't resist trying the vending machine's french fries. It was not a good experience. Don't do it. Why do Japanese say konnichiwa? Konnichiwa is often translated as good day or good afternoon. Konnichi, however, only means today and wa is a topic marker. So it actually means something like today is or just today. Why is that so? It is simply an abbreviation for konnichiwa gokigen ikaga desu ka? Or how are you feeling today? Not finishing the sentence also adds a bit of a zen-like notion to it because it only says today is and lets the dialogue partner finish the sentence quietly for himself. Why are Japanese apartments not heated? The first time I was in Japan in winter was shocking to me. Japan can be a cold country. Coming from Germany, I was used to central heating systems. And even though it may be cold outside, cozy warm temperatures inside of buildings. Not in Japan. Most buildings have close to no insulation and no heating systems except for air conditions. Why would anybody in a developed country like Japan do this to themselves? There seem to be many answers to this question, but the most common one is that houses are rebuilt too often because of the earthquakes and therefore it is seen as too expensive to invest in a central heating system. Why are there so many churches in Japan? Less than 1% of the Japanese population is Christian. Still, there are big churches and chapels all over the country. 
Why? Because most of them are not actually Christian. They are built by wedding companies who want to satisfy the widely popular image of a wedding in a chapel or church. Why are there so many overhead power lines? Another thing you will soon notice when you come to Japan are the webs of wires in the air. Japan has such great views. Why aren't they subterranean? According to the Tokyo Electric Power Corporation, or TEPCO, it is harder to isolate a damaged subterranean system in the event of landslides or flooding. The real reason, however, has probably a commercial background. The installation of subterranean systems is much more expensive. Now you have the answers to seven questions I had when I came to Japan. If you have any questions that aren't answered yet, please feel invited to share them with us in the comments. And remember, if you like this video, please give it a like and subscribe.